saw 14,840 new confirmed patients and 242 deaths on Wednesday. This is a massive jump from the past couple of days. It's insane, and that's right. Usually there's about maybe 50 to 90 people that die a day from the coronavirus. Now it's 255 people that died. That's 159 more people, and the day is still not over. Total number of infected people in mainland China is expected to be around the 60,000 mark. That's right, over 60,000 people infected worldwide, and the death toll is now over 1,300. It's actually 1,369. How many people have died since the coronavirus outbreak began in China? Tencent might have accidentally released the real numbers on the Wuhan coronavirus death. Saturday, Tencent briefly listed online over 154,000 cases of infections and over 24,000 cases of deaths. Apparently that was fake, or was it? One source of information is funeral homes in Wuhan. Our reporter, Undercover, called them up, and the numbers they disclose are heart-wrenching. It takes a crematorium on average 1.5 to 3 hours to process a body. So the total number of dead being processed by the 14 cremators of the Hanka funeral home would be closer to 112 to 224 per day. <laughs> Okay, so basically what they said in that news, I did some math. So we'll say average of one crematorium does about 150 bodies a day. And there's about 14 to 20 crematoriums in China, and they're all running 24 hours a day. So let's just say 150 times 20 is about 3,000 bodies a day. And it's been about 10 days. Well, actually 12, but let's just say 10 days. So that's 30,000 people. Uh, just estimate that the crematoriums could have burned or disposed of and that's where those numbers that pop up uh, you know are they actually fake or were they actually leaked I don't I don't know like it's just the the numbers from the crematoriums like you know it just is staggering and shocking when you think about it and that's being conservative considering that the lady said that they can burn anywhere from 112 to 224 bodies a day off of 14 furnaces and they have 30 f furnaces in one crematorium so yeah yeah, you do the numbers there and let me know in the comments below on how many possible people they could be crematorium or burning because that's a lot of, a lot of people. Only about 6% of the deaths are recorded as confirmed cases. If other funeral homes in Wuhan are in the same situation, where only 6% of the deaths are counted officially as part of the coronavirus death toll, the real number of lives claimed by the virus could be over 10,000. Exactly, and at those crematoriums at maximum capacity, that number I was telling you guys about is about 9,600 people a day. People who speak out with views different from the Chinese regime continue to be under threat. China has summoned or detained several doctors and citizen journalists since the outbreak started. And in 10 days, that's 96,000 people that could possibly have been killed. And the crazy thing on this website, I'll be putting the link in the description below, you can check it out. It actually says that China has plus 255 deaths today so they actually haven't announced on how many people have died today to the who as well as total critical condition is 8200 people and usually once you're in critical that means you're probably going to die so it makes you really wonder what the actual numbers are what is china hiding or trying to cover up what are they lying because like you see all those videos spreading around and like it just doesn't make any sense nothing adds up but my heart and my prayers go to all the families that are affected by this and just all we can do is just pray and just like God bless everybody and the animals and just every just you know this is just a tragic like you know this is a pandemic like you know and like this is like an epidemic like you know we need to like protect ourselves like and our governments need to start acknowledging it and like it's just blows my mind let me know what you guys think in the comments below and you know like this video because it helps share and spread the awareness as well as subscribing thanks for watching everyone